They're warming up third grade style in Gary Anderson's PE class at Governor's Ranch Elementary. But you won't find jumping jacks and mad ball on the fitness menu today. These kids are learning something new and a little exotic. This was tenickling. 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 Anderson partnered with Governor's Ranch music teacher Erica Brinkman to introduce Tenickling to the school. It's a high energy dance that offers up lots of aerobic exercise and plenty of all out fun. I actually uh, went to a collaborative schools training last year and it really planted a seed in my head that something that I wanted to do with Erica. And I think the two of us, she's done Tenickling before and I want to do something new, so. While relatively new in this country, Tenickling is a traditional Philippine dance that dates back to the Spanish colonial era. The locals there were inspired to mimic the movements of long-legged cranes as the birds picked their way through rice paddies. In the rice grains, they walk sideways through the rice grains. Do that again, they walk like what? Like that. They walk sideways through okay. them. So they adapted it to um, a pole kind of a dance that they used the bamboo poles for. In the Philippines it's done in 3-4 time, but here in the U.S. we've adapted it to 4-4 time so we can use more music. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, there we go. One, two, three, four. And it allows the kids to really have to count the beats so they don't get their ankles slammed between the poles, which they learn pretty quickly. Oh, it's a lot of activity going on because you have to jump in, jump out, and like you're helping your teammates and everything. Well, I think it's really fun to be doing it. My favorite is a hip hop step. all getting their heart rate elevated and as much as I like the exercise part, the teamwork part is the one that I've really been emphasizing in class. The kids are always excited whenever it's tenickling time and their teachers love what happens each time the poles come out and the music starts to play. Laughter. <laughs> joy. Yeah, they're, they're having so much joy and some of them are surprising themselves with how good they, they are at doing this. If you like, like being active and jumping then you should try it. If you don't really like jumping and everything it's still a fun sport or fun game to play because you can just sit and still be part of it. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. 